Right, we've been talking about the best, best party you've ever been to, and I'd like to discuss with you one or two more general questions related mm -hmm. to this. So, let's consider first of all family parties in your country. How do families celebrate birthdays in your country? Mm. I think it depends on the families. But it's, uh, my family is something like uh, you go to the restaurant and have a good time together, something like that. And after that, uh, we have the big, you know, cake and the candles. That's um, to indicate how old are you. So just only that. So, so that's, that's your family. Do you think it's the it's, same for other families too? I think it's quite similar because it's, uh, mm -hmm. in Thailand when you have the parties, the main thing is you have to eat <laughs> the first thing uh, in the restaurant or in the house. That mm -hmm. is the, the first thing you have to do. The second thing is you have to have the cake. That's to indicate mm. that's a birthday. Do you think that, um, that family celebrations have changed during your lifetime? I think it's quite similar because after, you know, I remember when I was very young so until now is is the same and it's, it's similar with other families so I think it's not changed. So in this case uh, in Thailand the traditions are continuing, they're not changing? They're not changed. Mm, interesting. Yeah. Alright, let's think about other parties now. Um, let's think about family parties and, and formal parties, the kind of parties maybe mm. you have in the office or in the university, something like that. What do you think are the differences between family parties and more formal parties? I think it's different in the costume or the clothes that mm -hmm. they wear. What kind of differences? Because um, in, you know, in the families, we can wear, you know, normal clothes, something like this. There is an outside clothes, you can, you can wear jeans, you can wear every clothes you want. But you, when you're in the something like formal party, mm -hmm. Uh, it's uh, something like work party, you have to wear a suit. Mm -hmm. And it's quite important to make, you know, something like a formal, formal shoot for that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, but in the something like, um, it's a party in the university. So you should have the long dress, beautiful dress, and you have to make your face very, very <laughs> fleshy and, and it looks very nice, very beautiful to, and attractive. Do you think these kinds of social events, these kinds of parties, do you think they're important in the life of the school or the life of the university, the life of the office? Do you think it's important for us to have them? Yes, it's a, it's a part of socials. So, so why, why is it important? It's important because um, you can, you know, in the party, it's a good time to communicate with the person. That maybe you haven't known or mm -hmm. you have known them, but maybe it's a good time to share your idea, to share what you think, and it's a good time to entertain yourself, to have, the, you know, something like, um, to have a good drink, good food, and good friend. So it's... Um, so it's not, not just, you know, just, not just entertains in my idea. Mm -hmm. Something like um, some parties I can share, you know, something like um, uh, my opinion in when, when I want something, for example. So it um, makes life easier in the office, for example. Yes, and mm -hmm. another thing is something like um, I have projects and I cannot, you know, do, do that project very well. So I can share with something like my friends who work in the you know law, law fields, or my friend who works in the business fields, and my background with education. So, so it gives you so, a chance to communicate yes, with so others. Yes, so we can share with each All other right. in the party. Thank you very much. That's the end of the speaking test. Thank you. Welcome.